This is a demonstration of my discrete FPGA. Each of these PCBs implements a single FPGA slice. Two bus lines in each direction connect each slice to its neighbours. Each slice can read from up to three bus lines and write independently to up to two. The Arduino is being used to program the FPGA. It's not required to operate it. First, we'll load the combination lock program. In this configuration, these four slices act as registers, storing in the data coming in on one of their bus lines when this common bus line is high. We'll set these ones to represent the number 13. And then store the data in the registers. These four slices act as comparators. Each one compares the two inputs, the stored one from the register and the current input, and output a 1 to the next comparator if and only if they match and they got a 1 from the comparator above them. This LED here will be lit only if the entered combination is correct. Next, let's load the PWM program. Now, these three slices act as a 3-bit counter, while these three slices act as a comparator, comparing the counter to the value we input on the bus lines. This last slice acts as an SR latch, turning this LED on when the comparator is equal, and off again when the counter overflows and resets. We'll set the counter to 5 and demonstrate it in slow motion. Now, let's see how it looks at full speed. As you can see, as we vary the input number, the brightness of this LED changes. 